Is no one opening your email? How do you know? Well, I'm Shama Maher, CEO of Scaling Retail, and I'm gonna actually show you some really great tips in order to get your emails opened by all the people who you actually want to be communicating with. Now, when you're launching and having a fashion business, chances are you're sending a lot of emails out to a lot of different kinds of people. Wholesale buyers, potentially editors, press people, influencers, you name it, right? Your goal is to get your brand in front of as many people as possible. Now, while you're probably sending out all these great personalized notes, you might be wondering to yourself, how do I know if anyone's actually reading them? How do I know if they actually like the content that I'm producing? Well, there are two things that you can do right now to actually ensure that your emails actually get read and open and even hopefully responded to. The very first thing you want to adopt is a casual yet confident email writing style. This goes not only just for the content inside, but also in that dreadful subject header, that subject header where you're hoping, crossing fingers, that that person's going to read it and actually want to open it. Now, let me give you a huge tip from here. The best subject headers that actually get opened up are ones that say, hi, or hello, or even circling back, or following up. These very simple subject headers actually have a certain level of confidence and continuality that your reader is ultimately gonna want to feel with you. So if you say hi in your subject header, that's way more disarming than spring, summer 16, new brand launching, right? You're screaming when you write subject headers like that. Now, the second thing you wanna do is make sure that you install an email tracking program. One of my favorites is actually by a company called Streak. It integrates super easily into any of your Gmail accounts and allows you to see who's opening up your email and when they are opening up your email. Now, this is crucial when it comes to doing any type of email marketing campaign, especially when you're not using an autoresponder like a MailChimp, right? You actually want to be able to see these one-on-one -on -one communications that you're writing, if the person's opening them or not, and if they are not opening them, this gives you an opportunity to resend that email with a different subject header using all the same content. So those are the two main things that you need to be working on when you send out your very next email. I guarantee you, you send an email to me with a very casual subject header, I'm probably gonna open it. Now, before I get off, I wanna remind you, the content that you write is really what's gonna be the clincher to get someone to respond back. So make sure all of that is on point, very direct, short, and specific. Nobody wants their time to be wasted. So keep that in mind when you're writing your next email. All right, guys, for more email marketing tips and ways to improve your business strategy, feel free to shoot me an email at shama at scalingretail.com. I'd love to hear how these email tricks and tips are working for you. So leave that comment down below. Come find me. I'm on Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, and YouTube. So I am where you are. Thanks so much, guys. Have a fantastic day. Bye.